Well, here's a data point 1100 made by Computer Terminal Corporation. I received this 1100 at the same time I received the 2200. I made several videos in a blog about that. That was their production unit. Uh, when I received this, um, the gentleman I received the donation from said that this 1100 was a prototype. I've been not able to find any information about the 1100 in the literature or from folks that worked at uh, Computer Terminal Corporation. Uh, it looks very similar, and there was certainly an intent here because the uh, type here is raised. This, this was made, uh, cast a piece of plastic here, and uh, the logo pointing to the right. The difference between this and the 2200 as far as the case is, of course, not only the logo, but the fact that there's no cassette uh, mass storage units here. Uh, Gordon Peterson worked for Control Terminal Corporation during the time this was made, and he says he doesn't remember anything about it. So we're doing this video, and maybe he or someone else can help shed a little light on this data point 1100. Let's take a look inside. Well, as I said, it looks very similar to the 2200 data point, other than the fact that it doesn't have the cassette interfaces here. It does have 16K of internal memory. These are 4-bit, I'm sorry, 4K byte cards, and there are four of them. So it has internal memory uh, read-write of at least 16K. What other memory it has on the boards, I'm not sure. If you go down here and look at the lower side, it also has the four big PC boards, or printed circuit boards, that uh, essentially contain the CPU in small-scale integrated circuits. Over here on one of the power supply boards, there is a serial number of 8933. 8933. The 2200 I had has a serial number in the range of 400 and something. So there's a couple of clues over here on the side that might help us. There's an accepted uh, quality control mark on the side dated 4-10-75. So this unit passed quality control in some form in 1975. There's a name on here. It's either F-O-Y or Roy, R-O-Y. I can't uh, decipher exactly what that is, but that's, uh, you'll see it there for yourself. Okay, these other clues I'm looking at, this is not necessarily a clue here, but the standard Data Point Corporation logo is on the lower part, but over here is a silver tag, it's a gluon tag. It says uh, model number 96-1131-001-2, serial number 100. Now the serial number 100 would sort of indicate to me this is the first one, because oftentimes companies didn't want to start with one, they would start with 100, 1000, 10,000. I would just about guess this is Serial number one may be one of a kind, but there's a little, there's one of these model number sides on the other side. We're going to see it has a little bit different nomenclature on it. Well, now look on the other side of this unit. Here's one of these tags for a serial number and model number. Serial number 1100-132A, serial number 100. So that corresponds, of course, 115 volts AC. And here's that... Uh, patch that indicated uh, made in 1975. So this would indicate again to me that it may be serial number one, but this distinctly says model 100-132A. Well, just to do a more or less a complete scan on this model 1100, uh, here it is still out of the case, but you see the backside is very similar to that 2200. Very, very similar. Here's another little clue that this might be a prototype. Uh, the date in here is uh, March 4, 1975. But the clue is that the way this panel has been glued in here, it's been glued in uh, rather crudely in a sense with this very heavy strip of glue like they took the original panel out 
and didn't use the standard technique which I'll show you in the 2200. So this panel looks like it was glued in sort of after the fact. Here's the 2200. See it's sort of bonded, the front panel bonded with just some sort of hot uh, plastic bonding here without the glue. So those are all the clues I could gather that might help us identify this model 1100 which we think may be a prototype of some sort, uh, maybe a very simple thing for uh, Computer Terminal Corporation, 1974-1975.